never thought I'd ever say. Yeah, who's on Team Villains? I'm kind of curious. Probably Zubat with Seth. Maybe? I don't know. I've been keeping up. Oh, speaking of, uh, we got <laughs> Zubat and Hunter on stream. Uh, ooh, going for that plat uh, tech chase with side B1. I, did, I do love saying that. Zubat is here. It's cool. Okay, that's that's a little bun. I gotta split those guys. Alright. Bad. Uh, historically, I know that Hunter pretty much farms Zubat in this this matchup. Like pretty much no matter who, who Zubat goes, but just specifically this matchup or like and with any with Sora. With I'm Sora. surprised Zubat has not gotten Sephiroth because no, he loses to Sephiroth. Oh, okay. Because from what from to my understanding, that's a very favorable matchup for Sephiroth. Yeah, but Hunter is unfortunately just the best player in the world. So True. and you know, um, Kingdom Hearts isn't he like? Is Sephiroth like the villain in like Kingdom Hearts? Isn't he like a villain in Kingdom Hearts? He's like oh. a secret boss in it, and it, okay. it's really simple. Yeah, in Kingdom Hearts, uh, yeah, Sora is unfortunately the, the protagonist, so can't uh, That is true. Yeah, protagonist you see these silly win. ass mods that Hunter keeps coming up with? What? Like, genuinely. Like, do you see this render? This nigga has the worst hair I've ever seen. Uh, yeah, but the voice sounds better than the no, no, Sora. No, no, you can't the, get, you literally just, it's just, it's, it's always just bad. His, his regular voice is at least, like, base game. But like any modded voice just, just sounds so I don't know, this sounds but the, the other one is it's just I don't I don't know, I just could not stand listening. I to cannot it. listen to Sora's voice anyways. It's like genu like and like what is this render? Like what is that hair that hair looks taped on. Like <laughs> Bro, that cut is garbage. And I, that robe is weird as fuck. Wow, here. that was a great up air out of, out of disadvantage. It works. Where, where are you going, Hunter? Oh my god. Yeah, I am surprised you did not punish that, but wow, okay, this is a great combo with the double jump bear. Side B. <laughs> the side B's have that really been so catching Zubat off guard. Yeah. It just kind of like beats out Zubat going for any A move. He has to like be like full hopping or using like needles or something to knock yep. himself down by it. Or just ready to react to play off yeah. that. You know, one of like Sheik's greatest strengths is can be edge guarding, uh, but in this matchup it looks like yeah. edge Sora, guarding. Sora's gone. Sora's Thank you. He's going to live off stage. And Blizzard but, on shield. But I do know that his, his area was really like. He's like really floaty, so I guess he probably won't be able to avoid stuff like needles now like this. Like, yeah. that well. But like you, you can see like like Hunter was like trying to like uh, like hug underneath the stage with up B yeah. so that like um so that was able to feel to hit him with anything, but Oh yeah, see? Oh uh, okay, never mind. Oh was, yeah, back okay. at stage back, that was good. No you, tech, that was great though. Yeah, I mean I mean I would have expected him to skip back yeah. at stage, like well, you know, I guess Hunter just, you know, sometimes he just kinda get blindsided, you know. Not me though, because I'm you know just really good. Is Sora even that light? Like I know, I know Sora's lighter, but like I don't think like Game and Watch light either. He's not, he's not Game and Watch light. He's like, he's like, a, I think he's a little bit lighter than Lucina. I could be dead wrong though. Oh, Lucina's like he's not that heavy. Like uh, oh, it's like it's like the lower end of mid weight. So okay. yeah, it's like yeah. Back air. We're playing now. All right. All right. You're trying to be grab someone in my crew. Uh, I don't want to fuck kill myself. I don't want to play against Connor. <laughs> All right. Bye. See ya. Good luck in your set. All right. You gonna join in commentary? I'll be track. I'm about to walk off for a bit, but I'll hop on for the sake this game. Sure. All right, perfect. I mean, it's one-to-one -one stocks right now. Yeah. Um, Considerable lead here for uh, Dick Saucer. Right? Yeah. <laughs> I I know the meaning behind that tag. I hate it so much. Wait, like the, there's a there's a specific meaning behind well, it. Like a, I think there's like a character he said. I don't know. I didn't watch the show. <laughs> there, it's a show on it. Th no, there's like a show where the character says it. I think. I don't oh, know. You okay. might have to bring Sora in, the expert. Okay. Or do you know? He's got Dick Saucer. Yeah. Wh why is that a tag? Yeah. It's a two-episode show. Check out Dragon Half, everybody. Yep. I. I don't even know what to say to that. Yep, uh, we got the lore at least. But there's a reason why he has a lead, so maybe it's because of that tag. I also thought that Nero was going to kill because of this Theon. God, I, that, that would have been a really bad way to go out. It's like 70% too. Yeah. But yeah, lots of rage on Hunter, so I mean, this could easily get flipped if it wanted to be. Um, Dash tech, not, not going to do it. It's probably yeah. been staled hella by now. Oh, that's it? Yep. That was great. That was a great call out. Getting with the needles to down B. Mm -hmm. Yo, Sean VGM says he's going to be at the Rochester local this Sunday. Beware. Everybody go to Rochester uh, this Sunday, 1 p.m. Med City Smash 100. Please, $100 prize pot. Oh, also, uh, Chess, no, I'm not in the tournament today. I'm just, like, spectating and stuff.
Uh, also, today was apparently really packed, right? 65. Sheesh, yeah, and stuff it was too. super duper capped at 64. I think there were a couple people that were waiting on DQs. I don't know yep. if we got everybody, yep. but we got a lot of people in. Uh, a lot of people from SGDQ today. A lot of people just out of state as well. Cool. It's cool. Uh, probably one of the more packed ones we've had for a while, which is great because, I mean, for Minnesota Smash, it's going to be a big week. Like, we have. The monthly, the Saturday freeze frame with so many out-of-staters, even besides this. Is that why like a lot of people are from out-of-state for this Advantage State too, because they're waiting for the monthly as well? Well, I, I'd assume probably one or two, but then I know a lot of the people here are just here for SGDQ. Okay. Um, which has been going on, so y'all yeah, check that out. I think uh, ending Sunday, I think? I don't know. Sun yeah, uh, when was it, July? I think it started the 26th. Three, Keep two, on. one, go! All right, uh, Kareem, I won't show, so you better go. I'll hold you to that. Nice. Hunter's been going for those throughout the set where it's just kind of like a jump, like side B and just kind of calls out whatever uh, Zubat's doing. Right. I'd like the I'd like to pick a battlefield. I, I don't think it's particularly bad for Sheik, which is why, of course, like it was left open. Yeah. But like, uh, dude, Sora can do so much stuff on this stage. He has so much like he has the space. I think is perfect for it. Like particularly this combo routes, just to have. I guess it's optimal amount of like room to breathe while also being claustrophobic. Yes. Yeah. Yes. I'm, yeah. I was just about to like say like, oh no, Sora's off stage. He's gonna get hit, but like his recovery's fine. Yeah. I mean, I mean, Zubat just randomly challenges uh, off, uh, Sora off stage too and kind of gets uh, like gets damage off of it too. He's gotten like uh, back air stage spikes in the past too. Oh yeah. Uh, the tricky thing with like specifically the like, floaties on like battlefield, it's kind of tricky versus like these like. Um, Characters are really good at juggling, right? Which oh, yeah. is why I, I, I personally like feel like really like nervous on this, but like um, you did mention that like Sora can like thrive on battlefield. Wow, yeah, two frames just catching the the beginning frames up there look like, and that down smash just like completely negating the, the chic down tilt that was underneath uh, the right platform there. That was wow. really good sequence there from Hunter. That was great. Okay, so now we got the offstage situation. I mean. Hunter usually can be pretty laid back here. Um, it's mostly the ledge trap where I feel like has been the scariest. Huh. Just because like it's just gonna continually reset. Oh, dropping it there, but like usually you're gonna continually reset until eventually you're gonna mess up and die. Yeah. Oh Great counter. Oh god, that was a really good counter. That's Ooh. the first counter you see in the set too. Yeah. Jeez, that, if that freeze hit, that would have been something else. Hunter's so good with spells, yeah. Yeah. It, it is interesting to see a character that, rather than just trying to land on stage, he's just kind of content just going off stage, knowing that he will probably not get challenged. Exactly. It's, it really takes, like, great awareness, I think, in that case, for sure. Yep. Which we're seeing from both players, to be honest, in this set. Yep. Why they're consistent top eighters. Great side oh, B. Oh, wow. All right. Well, Hunter is just building up this lead more and more and more. Um, I am interested to see how Zubed's going to take this stock. Right. This is looking very precarious now. It's 61. I mean, like, sure, Sora isn't known for, like, rage kills, but, like, he can kill you super early if you give him a chance. There could be something, where you, yep, like that. Yeah. Like, like, some kind of smash attack out of nowhere. I, I don't really see Hunter use F smash, at least in this set. Uh -huh. um, but, like, we've seen the down smash. We've seen the up smash now. Oh, yeah. Uh, and, like, Hunter, I do know, is not afraid to let that up smash rip when given the chance. Yep. So, one messed up here from Big Saucer. It could be it. Or, sorry, D Saucer. <laughs> According to Thor in the chat. Good to see you, Thor. That's it? Yep. I'll take that. Solid three stack there from Hunter. 172. Sheik Idis really kicking in that match. Yeah. So, I mean, this is a complete opposite of whatever the last game was. Oh, uh, yeah, where like, it was like fairly commanding on uh, Dick Saucer's end, and now it's yeah. uh, very uh, commanding there from Hunter. So, it's, I don't. Aaron, do you feel like the stage made that big of a difference, or just kind of like adaptation there? I mean, I, I, I'm someone who subscribes to the theory that stages like really do make styles of gameplay, and that like definitely showcases there, but I think also. Just Hunter just really adapted as well, which I think is really good. Yep. I am curious if um, Zubat's gonna opt for a stage that doesn't have, uh, or that has walls to kind of like limit Sora's recovery just a bit more. Right, just, just to constrict him a little bit more because like Sheik's, Sheik's a, half of Sheik's advantage really is like her edge guarding ability, how yep. far she can go. If you can't do it against Sora, it's so difficult. Also, that was a very funny song we just heard. I I, I had to double check, like, I did like a double take. I was not sure if I heard that right. Mm -hmm. Put it down to Richard Saucer. Richard Saucer. Oh. That's, a, that's a good one. Uh, also, I did not watch Dragon Half. I have like a counting headache. I think that's what you guys were watching, Ruby. Oh, sorry. Violet? Okay. Yeah, Violet's a good okay, one. Cool. Minnesota! I just realized this is in game tag again. Let's go! I don't know if he's ever stopped using I just realized that was his in game tag just now, though. <laughs> Wait. Let's get some Minnesotas in the chat. Nice, let's go. 
Ooh, off tilt. All right, wow. All right, 53 right there. I don't know what the side B was, but like... Okay, punish on the side B. He came to dinner so he can play on stream, uh, Holly. With the, the Shulk, he's really kicking it up now. Wait, what? Ken has a Shulk? Yeah, he dropped Kirby, I think. What did that happen? What the heck? I have no idea how, when that happened, but I'm pretty sure he's just a Shulk guy now. Alright, I gotta ask Ken. That's crazy. <laughs> That's awesome, though. I'm very happy. For me, deserves a stop there. He's so good. Yeah, yeah, no, Ken's crazy. Alright. Oh, Alright, so, I mean, here's the ledge trap. This is where um, I feel like you guys got it most of, like, kills. Just kind of a lot of the damage is wide to the edge. Alright. Ooh. Oh. Not timing it. He yep. was just a second off. Yep. I really like the idea there from Hunter though. I want we'll to end it right there. Yeah. Yep, the charge is good. Some people I just like let it rip right away, but like if you get a read on that time when they come out. Oh. That was kind of surprising, but yep. Hunter, living to see another day. That dash tech is such a good burst option. It's so good. Running in there. The also, cameras. yeah, these cameras turning into the void. <laughs> That must have been like a hurtbox extension. Maybe Zubat, oh sorry, Violet went for like up tilt there. Yeah, but I, yeah, I guess so. I mean, that's I very surprised that like was it accidentally an up tilt or an up air? Like I, I didn't see the first turn up there. Yeah, but Hunter taking that stock and he's getting some extra credit on too. Okay, that back air does not kill and like unfortunately, like unfortunately for Violet, like just sending a character far enough does not work in this matchup. Right. Very good box there. A lot there. of jab damage, but. Right here, honestly. Yeah. yeah. It's like keeping Hunter at ledge is one thing, but can uh, take saucer clutch up here? The clutch is down tilt up here. Yep. There we go. Perfect spacing for the down tilt. That was All very right. good. Hunter has been great at maintaining the lead here he has, though, so. Already a ledge? Ooh, interesting. Okay. This could be a lot of damage here from Dick Saucer. Good <laughs> side. Right. Hunter kind of reversing situation, violated in the corner this time. Ooh, double there. Dash attack. Okay. I gotta say though, one thing that's like really important to note from like people playing against these Vortex characters is that like people's mental after they get hit by all of these like crazy strings that last forever. It's and like very tilting. Yeah, it's super tilting. It's easy to get caught into like the mind game like, oh I'm in this forever. Yep. But Hunter's been so stalwart, I think. He's been doing really good. Yep. Like he's still in this match by I mean I, I would still give him the edge just because of Sora's rock power for right yep. now. It's, it's actually insane, and it's honestly, I'm even surprised that, um, like, I'm just, like, still in the game this much, just because 90% of this game has been at the ledge. Like, I feel like I barely see the game at center stage. Right. Wow, Ooh. okay, that was a great, uh, Fire Aga to up air. Oh, yeah, Fire Aga, like, you don't think you'd be able to combo like it does, but it's such a good combo tool. It, it honestly makes oh. for, like, some of the best clips that, like, Sora can do, too. Oh, for sure. And, like, clip kill confirms, like, the majority of the sauce. Yeah. That might no, uh, no. Nope, still alive. And at least uh, it's connected. Okay. That, that, was a, that was a backer, right? That's a backer, right? Okay. Oh, I like going for the up tilt there, thinking that uh and knowing that Dixos was gonna press another button, but like I frame staying out there for a bit longer and Hunter back in the disadvantage. Bouncy fish. Yep, yep there we go. Nice. Alright, that I even Steven's right about now. This is best of three. This is the best of three, yeah. Very Same. this is surprisingly early in bracket. I mean I will say uh, Violet's had a, a tough practice so far. I don't have to play Meat Flash. Like oh. a round four. Coming out on top there, of course, but wow. like, yeah. Yeah, I mean, this is winners and you're seeing this match like kind of early. That's, that's pretty crazy. But that yeah. just goes to show like the amount of like good players that we have here. We yeah. gotta have like these players playing it out in a winner's round three. Insane. What is that day, yeah. Super sad. But it's good to see. Like, it back to form right now. Like, we're really getting back in the summer entrance. It's super cool. Hunter back at ledge. Yep. That's so good. Such a, and like a wow. low profile too, and like, but like, yeah, uh, Dick Saucer just running her right back to ledge. Ooh, the needles. I like the idea, but like, Sora's uh, ledge hang so good, and probably avoiding actually. That, yeah, that's tough to pull off. Oh, gosh. All right. Let's see. I and mean, air bounce crush. Yep, air bounce crush. That's it. Great. Yeah. And good so, clutch there. 2 1 from, uh, from Dick Saucer. From. Um, from Richard Saucer. From Richard Saucer, yeah. Richard I Von hate Saucer. that tag so much. And I hate this tag. I just... <laughs> it's like... It's a commentator... It's a true commentator's curse. Because you yeah. have to acknowledge it, right? Yes. But then, like... No matter what, you don't support it. Uh, who won? It would be... Yep, Violet. That's yep. It. Yep, thank you. <laughs> good clutch, good clutch. Uh, I don't know yeah, who no, we have next Yeah, that was a great set. Who do we have next on stream?